Hello! Let's go through a brief overview of some of the exciting new features and enhancements available in Jamf Pro 11.19. A new dialog appears when trying to save smart or static groups and classes that are currently being used in the scope of another Jamf Pro object. This helps prevent accidental or unwanted changes that may have otherwise had major consequences. For example, when trying to save this smart group with broken logic, the alert appears stating the scope of the Midwest Wi-Fi profile would be affected. As it's currently configured, all devices would be removed and there would be zero devices in the group. Correcting the logic and trying to save again, now we can see the number of devices being added to the total. This setting is turned on by default in Jamf Pro 11.19 and can be controlled by navigating to Settings, System, Impact Alert Notifications. An additional setting allows administrators to enable one more layer of security by requiring Jamf Pro users to type commit in the criteria before saving. Another addition to smart and static groups in Jamf Pro 11.19 is the description field. This allows the display name to be shortened for more efficient naming conventions while an in-depth explanation of how the group is used can be left here. Descriptions appear in a column in the list of groups, and a tooltip pops up for long descriptions. Administrators utilizing the ACME certificate payload of a computer or mobile device configuration profile now have the option to automatically redistribute certificates at a specific number of days before they expire. To enable automatic certificate redistribution, choose a number of days from the Redistribute Profile pop-up menu. Administrators may have noticed a new Self-Service Plus deployment option in Jamf Pro 11.17.1 or later as it was rolled out regionally through June and early July. Rollout is now complete and automatic deployment of Self-Service Plus can be configured by navigating to Settings, Jamf Apps, Self-Service Plus. Click Edit, select the checkbox, then click Save. With this setting enabled, the next time computers check in with Jamf Pro, Self-Service Classic is removed and Self-Service Plus is installed. Branding and other configuration options remain in Settings, Self-Service. That's all for our quick overview of some of the new features introduced in Jamf Pro 11.19. Be sure to visit the Jamf Pro release notes in the Jamf Learning Hub at learn.jamf.com for requirements and details about the features we've covered and to review all of the exciting updates in this version. Thanks for watching.